Hi guys and welcome to my channel. This is a day in the life of a stay-at-home mom and babysitter. Now, the joys of being a parent just never seem to end. You can see the evidence of that on my son's face. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, let me tell you about this story over here. Over here, <laughs> over here, over here, over here. So yeah, guys. <sighs> the roommate left out some white out and unfortunately Parker decided that he was going to play with that and paint his face. So I read online that like the only thing that can really take that off is um, alcohol, like rubbing alcohol and um, a fingernail polish remover. Well, the thing with that is he got it on his eyelids, on his eyelashes, like all under his eyes too. So I'm like super like scared to like even attempt to try to use that on him, which I'm not, but um, I was thinking coconut oil, perhaps, or baby oil. Um, have y'all ever had your child do this to you? Because I'm like, I don't even know where to start because I've never had this problem before. But if you have any tips or suggestions, please comment down below. Please, 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 because I need help ASAP. By the way, guys, this is Noli. Say hi, Noli. He's my blonde baby that I didn't have. Parker. Parker. All right, well, he's one, and we are just now really starting to talk, so. Are you starstruck? Cat got your tongue. So while the pizza's cooking, I have on, well, you can't really see it, right there, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. And Parker is having a little snack while we wait. Look at that face, guys. <sighs> the joy is apparent, King. They just never told you all the highlights of it. Right, Nolan? We're still not talking, huh? <laughs> He's such a little ham. I love these boys. So guys, I pretty much watched Nolan from like 9.30 to 6.30, sometimes 7. Um, so it's a full day with him and both boys are potty training right now and it's a little crazy around here but um, I just wanted to share with y'all um, what I'll be making for dinner later. And I'm not sure, but if you checked my other hauls, then at the 99 cent only store, I hauled two bags of the frozen orange chicken. And I believe they were $2.99 a bag. And honestly, guys, it's really not that cheap in the store. Like, it is so expensive to buy prepared frozen foods. So, let me just show y'all in case y'all missed it. But I picked up two of these. And it's by, I think, Sumi. And it is a one and a half pound bag. Ready to cook chicken, popcorn fritters, and orange sauce. So basically all you do is you bake it at 400 for 18 to 20 minutes. Or you can deep fry it, which is awesome. I do have a deep fryer. And I know a lot of y'all are probably thinking, why do you have a deep fryer? Don't you know about those cool things called air fryers? Yes, I do know, guys. I really, really want one, but I want to make sure I'm getting a good one, and I want to make sure I'm getting a good deal on it as well. I don't want to spend an arm and a leg on it. Um, so I'm just waiting for a really good um, sale so that I can snag one. But eventually, I do want to get rid of this bad boy. I've had him for years, and obviously, deep frying is not healthy for you or your family. So... I do not promote that, even though I have one, okay? <laughs> it's a bad habit. But, um, 
anyways, I do want to get one of those, but I'm going to make some um, fried rice. So basically, I'm just going to go ahead and cook my basmati rice. Now, that is what we prefer in the household. But you can pick any kind of rice that you prefer. Um, if you like the wild rice or you like regular white rice or brown rice or whatever, use that as your base. So you just cook the rice as normal. Now, I like to add sesame uh, oil. I like to add a little bit of the soy sauce. And I get the uh, low sodium one, guys. And um, then I, like, we don't really have carrot lovers in the house, so I don't put any carrots in there. I'm gonna put some peas in there, and then I'm gonna do my eggs. And I'm probably gonna put, like, a little bit of chili flakes in there and I don't have any green onion I wish I did because I'd totally put that in there so normally I would do that but I don't have that so I'm just gonna make the rice with those ingredients cook it up real fast and then put the chicken in the oven and get that all together and then put the chicken on top of the rice and um, make some egg rolls and voila quick meal for $2.99 basically because I had all my other ingredients, so you really cannot beat that. If you have a 99 cent only store in your area, I really encourage you to go check it out if you haven't because they have amazing, amazing deals on food. And not just any food, like name brand foods that you would see at Walmart, Target, Kroger, seriously so let me just show you as an example what I picked up from this store the 99 cent only store and I actually want to go back to get some more of these because my family loves them so this is the 12 pack of the nature valley sweet and salty nut and this is the variety pack so it does have almond and peanut 12 bars so um, I have a good four bars left, so that's not too bad, but, um, guys, for a buck, a dollar, the best buy date on this is, like, man, I, I knew it earlier, and I was going to tell y'all, but, of course, now I'm looking at it, and I have no clue. Okay, here it is. So, it's February 4th. So actually, this box is good because it will be eaten right before the 4th, which is this weekend, I believe. So um, if I go back and pick up another one of these, I will definitely, definitely be checking the Best Buy date to make sure that it goes out past the 4th, obviously. But this is just an example of how much money you can save. A dollar versus what, $3.98 maybe in the store? four I don't know something like that so to me it's really worth it guys definitely definitely go check it out and the guys the pizza is ready yes all right I got the pizza out of the oven and on the plate ready to serve up for the boys as y'all know, mother's work is never done, so I brought y'all with me to the kitchen, and I'm about to clean up.
Now these little guys are eating their pizza. And we have a TV in the kitchen, so they're watching Dinosaur Train. And now, Mama is going to do some more cleaning, a.k.a. tackling the living room. Disaster, I know. So, come with me and clean. So, lunch is still going on, but as you can see, I did pick up the living room, so that is good to go. Now, what I like to do after lunch and when the kids take a nap is watch Gilmore Girls. I just watch one episode. Sometimes I don't even get through an episode. I like to do a load of laundry as well and pick up more around the house, which is what I'm going to do now. and star so I just pressed Netflix and it goes instantly to my account guys is that not amazing <sighs> so amazing it's time for some Gilmore girls come on internet's slow today Mm -mm -mm. All right, guys, so I was going to watch Gilmore Girls, but this is better. Okay, guys, so I actually ran out of battery life, and I forgot to end my video yesterday. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed a day in the life of being a stay-at-home mom and babysitter. Um, if you like vlog style videos and if you want to see more or if you have any suggestions for me, please let me know. Comment down below. If you like videos like this or you want to see more, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe so you can keep up with me. And I want to keep up with you too. I want to get to know y'all. And um, thank you for taking the time to watch this. And um, have a great day. Bye.